The Texas Sportsman is brought to you by the City of Far, the Far Event Center, Capital Farm Credit, and Miller Lite. Hey folks, welcome to the Texas Fortune. We're in beautiful South Pedro Island, and I'm with the one and only Dirty Al. Dirty Al, you ready to go catch some fish with me? Hey, always. All right. I'm ready. All right. And of course, we got Cameron. Cameron, you ready to do it? Doing it, man. Doing All right. it. All right. And we're guided out here today with Captain John Reese, Big John Reese. So stay with us on the Texas Sportsman, and I tell you what, we're going to tell you about all the locations that Dirty Owl has here on South Padre Island, McAllen, Brownsville, Port Isabel. What I say is, gotta have it. We'll be right back on the Texas Sportsman. Tracking outdoors, gotta have it. Cameron's letting this big old trout, probably 28 inch speckled trout, go back to live and catch another day. Keep working him. Give him some water, give him some oxygen. Pull the fish right through for a minute. Take another picture. Let me move over here. Ha, ha, ha. 
I was over there now that I can get back over here and uh, the Texas Sportsman. I'll tell you what, folks. Hey, when you go fishing down here at South Padre Island, okay, you want to book a trip, book it with Big John. When you want to go eat, you're going to go eat at Dirty Owls. When you catch a fish like this, take it to any of the restaurants, right, Kevin? We'll cook it up, man. And they will cook it up, black and fried, broil, you name it, they got it. As I say, got to have it. We'll be right back on the Texas Sportsman, tracking outdoors.
The area's leaders in buying, selling, and pawning items is all about guns this season. From handguns for personal protection to rifles for target shooting and hunting, you'll find the best deal for your money at First Cash Pawn. Buy, sell, and pawn. If you need quick cash and you need it now, stop by any of the many First Cash Pawn locations and get the cash you need now. And First Cash Pawn pays top dollars for guns. First Cash Pawn, number one for buying, number one for selling, and number one for pawning. First Cash Pawn, you know there's one near you. Book your next outdoor adventure with the Texas Sportsman. If you want to go deer hunting, give Fred Rodriguez, the Texas Sportsman, a call. And book your next hunt and experience the hunt of a lifetime. From individual hunts or father and son hunts or family hunts. From doe, cull, management, or trophy bucks. Call the Texas Sportsman now at 956-776-4623. That's 956-776-4623. Gotta have it. Hey folks, welcome back to the Texas Sportsman. This is my favorite part right here. When you get back and you get ready to start eating this stuff right here. And the beautiful fish, we went fishing, we had a great time. And Cameron, you caught some big fish out there, you had a great time. I had a real good time. Okay, well, right now what we're at, we're in Port Isabel at Pelican Station. And Chef Cameron is going to show us how he's going to prepare this redfish on the half shell. So take it away, buddy. We're going to baste it with a little bit of scampi butter on, on, the, on the top side first of the filet. We're going to get into this dirty al grill spice. We're going to put on a, a good layer. We'll get these two filets on the grill. Plus, we got a little treat for you, Dirty Owl. My dad's own uh, thing that he loves to do is he loves to butterfly uh, fish heads. And uh, he loves to put these on the grill, man. The cheeks of the redfish, there's a lot of meat in there that a lot of people don't know about that ends up in the trash. Another one of Dirty Owl's favorite things to do is, is fish throats. There's huge pockets of meat in these, not a lot of bones, so you don't have to be too scared that someone's gonna get a bone in their throat because the bones that are in there are pretty large and the pockets of meat are super moist and they just stay delicious. I don't know anywhere else they do it, maybe China, but down here we do it all the time, so. Hey Cameron, one of the things that I love to do is cook also, okay? I'm the main cook at my house. And however, I'm checking it out right now and it just blew me away when I see the fish on there. Why, why do you do it like that first? I want to put those char marks on one side. I think the char marks really give it that flavor. That's why I also butter it a lot of times too. People think it's, you're putting the butter on to 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 get it to not to stick, but it's not actually to stick. You want it, you want it to burn a little bit. You want that, that mesquite flavor and those little black lines on that fish, you know? But uh, that's basically why I do it. Okay, well, I'm going to do it like that now. That's a Dirty Al's secret. Hey, folks, the one and only Dirty Al's here in the house, okay, at Pelican Station. Is he doing it right? Have you showed him right? Hey, I, I done it, and I teach him everything I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's looking great. How you doing today? Real good, sir. Beautiful day out Beautiful here. Beautiful day. Look at this weather. 
It's great. A lot of people at the island. That's right. I'm sure they're eating at one of your restaurants. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you got to do. The one thing you want to preserve is uh, you want to preserve that juice that's in the bottom of those oysters. So don't pour it out. Don't move them around too much. And then you just put in that avocado butter. It's a, it's a sauce that we make with fresh avocados, cilantro, serranos, and uh, garlic. And just the avocado acts as the oil, but it gives it that pretty color too. But it's, you're in for a treat, man. Here we go, guys. I'm going in. Owlid looks delicious. You're about done there. They're so good, man. Oh my god. You guys, you eat the oysters. You need to come over here. Pelican Station, 30 Owls, Daddy. They got them all, right? Oh, but oh, this is delicious. We're going to get it from Marty right here. Okay. Cameron Clive. Uh, Marty, what do you love about these oysters? It's just so good. I love the cilantro and the avocado and the lime all mixed together. It's just so delicious. And I did not like oysters before, but grilled on the barbecue pit with a mesquite flavor really makes it stand out. It enhances the flavor. Dig in. Looks yeah. Well, that wraps up another edition of the Texas Sportsman. Dirty Al, we had a great time out here, man. Thank you, sir. We had a great time. It was a, it was an honor to fish with you. You do so much work for the community, your family, all your your staff, your employees, all the restaurants. I mean, you do so much here for South Padre Island and the Rio Grande Valley. So we want to thank you. Thank okay. you. We take our hats off for you, but yes, sir. I have that much hair, no. but it's okay. <laughs> we had a good time. How about you? Me too. All right, great time. Good deal. No matter, no matter if I got burned on me, got burned. It was worth it. It was for a cause. <laughs> got a little burn. Got yeah. a little sun. Yeah, Cameron, you have a good time out there. I had buddy? a good time. Tell man. me about that big trout again. One more time, man. Monster trout. Caught them on croakers. Never used live croakers before. I mean, this trout was big. I mean, I, I released it, so I can't tell you the exact size of it, but it was big. The biggest trout I've caught in my entire life of fishing in the lower loop of the market. So. It was great, man. When I saw you, your eyes went like that, and uh, Papa over here went like that, <laughs> you know, and he was a big old fish. Oh, no, he but It was impressive, man. It was impressive. I was not ready to catch something like that today. Well, Big John put us on him. Yeah, man. Big, thank did. you, Big John. Impressive, man. Look, impressive. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm proud that you were able to let that fish go. It takes a lot. But Gotta do it, man. You gotta leave man. something. Well, that was that was really great. Great time. Hey, folks, you want to book a trip? Make sure you book it right here with Captain John Reese. Uh, if you want to eat some great food, of course, we gotta hit up all these fine restaurants right here with Dirty Al, starting right here in the original. Okay, and remember what I told you. We go way back. All right. Until next week, we'll see you on the Texas Sportsman Tracking Outdoors. Gotta have it. The Texas Sportsman was brought to you by the City of Far, the Far Event Center, Capital Farm Credit, and Miller Lite.